Hey everybody, this is Ryan, and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Terraria! And if you looked very quickly down in the bottom, you would have noticed that Orshabal is finally coming! <laughs> That's right, actually, I need to turn that battle potion off, because I already got him. And uh, I don't need to make anything too exciting. Alright, so, oh, there's a ring too, holy crap! Um, alright, so anyway, so what happens now? Oh, there, oh, okay, oh, oh, shit, holy, what the, what the fuck just happened? <laughs> what, what is going on? Okay, uh, it looks like an insane amount of demons came. Orshabal is also in there. Did I kill him? Uh, let's pick all this stuff up, find out. There's not really any good gear. I mean, this is all... I think these are all just like, uh, just demon drops. Huh. Well, anyway... <laughs> So what happens now, you might remember that I had a really hard time getting Orshabal to spawn last time. And so what you do now is uh, there's these tunnels that appear. And they work just like the other tunnels, like the other little like spawn tunnels you find in the game. And uh, really, as long as you just don't kill it, as long as you just let the tunnel sit there and like come to its maturity, I guess, uh, Orshabal should come out. Alright, so I never got the message, but he has spawned it. Okay, so Orshabal is in there. He looks just like the other demons. It's just a ton of ancient demons and Orshabal. And they are just destroying everything like demons typically do. They just say, oh yeah, I'm just going to destroy your entire world. Hope you're cool with that. Alright, so yeah, he is down there. He has trapped himself. And all right, so there's there's more tunnels. <laughs> I don't know if that's a new. That must be a new tunnel. Yeah, there's just there's lots of Orsha balls right now, mainly thanks to my battle potion. But yes, I waited a long time for this. I spent. Literally hours looking for you, Orshaval. And now you're gonna die like a sucker. You got more? I can't even like look through this. Yeah, there's just more just constantly coming at this point. Just getting completely overloaded with Orshavals and demons. Alright, well there's another Orshaval. Worship all in his demon posse. I'm not scared of you, Worship all, because I have Bolt 4, and Bolt 4 completely obliterates everything ever, ever. Alright, we're gonna turn the battle potion off. And kill him one more time, just for good measure. Take all of this wonderful loot. See if anything... Here's a stuffed dragon, which I have a ton of. Well, it doesn't look like I got any amazing loot from finally killing Orshabal. But, um, I did finally kill him. <laughs> which is the very important thing. Oh my god, I spent so long looking for him. You don't, you don't even understand. Stand! How many hours I spent, how many battle potions I spent. But I found him, there he is, he's dead, that's how it works. Yeah, you just uh, find those tunnels, they appear on the right side, uh, usually uh, very close to either your dungeon or your, uh, your swamp, depending on whatever you have over there. Sometimes even just slightly, like if you notice with mine, it was just slightly in the swamp. Yeah, if you wanna if you wanna kill Orshabal very quickly, just use Bolt Four. <laughs> that is how to end that fight. 
uh, pretty much immediately. But really, with just about anything in this game, if you want to end the fight immediately, just throw down some Bolt 4. Not that it's overpowered or anything, it's just, you know, it's insanely powerful. <laughs> and it kills everything in a matter of seconds. I got nothing wrong with that. No, no, no. I'm perfectly happy with that situation. <laughs> Alright guys, so we got one more boss we're going to try to get. So take a look at the moon. The moon is a backwards C. That is a, it's a type of crescent moon. And uh, what you do is you come here to the dungeon. When you have that moon, you might want to take a battle potion. You might want to use your water candle just to be safe because I'm using all of it because... Well, you don't get that type of moon very often. It takes a long time for it to come back around. And you come to your dungeon, and hopefully I will show you what happens. So we got a lot of demons. Oh, is that him? There he is! <laughs> He's a, uh, yeah, fir firm, firm a boss. Something like that, but there he is! He finally showed up! Oh yeah, I took a mushroom. Great. Great. Yeah, it's not that hard of a fight because, well, my guy is crazy overpowered. Alright, so this is not a bug that he keeps disappearing. I need, I really need to turn that off. It's just, it's supposed to make the fight harder. And, well, it kind of does because you can't really see where he's at. So it definitely does make the fight harder. Um... Also makes the fight harder when I can't do anything. This is actually a mildly challenging fight. It didn't help that I took a mushroom, that's for sure. But yeah, okay, I, I think I, I got him backed up against the wall now. Look at that, that's an awesome design. I wish I wish he wouldn't disappear so I could see him better. But he is now dead and he dropped some, he dropped, uh, what did he drop, Boots of Haste? So, alright, yeah, it looks like he dropped Boots of Haste, which add 20% speed, which, uh, you got you gotta love moving faster in this game. But there you go! That was the other mini-boss that I could not get to spawn, and, uh, so that's how you do it. You wait until you have, oh, now I don't have my, my thing of light. But yeah, you wait until you have that backward C of a moon... And man, looks like he spawned at the last second it must have been to, to get that to work. But yeah, there you go. So there are the last two mini bosses. There's Orshaball. Unfortunately, I couldn't get any Orshaball drops. But uh, yeah, that's how that's how you get them to... Uh, well, that's how you find them, I guess. And uh, yeah. So there you go. There's only one video left. Only one more video. And we're fighting, uh, we're fighting Chaos, which is going to be... It's going to be fun. It's going to be really fun. <laughs> so that is going to do it for this video, guys. Uh, thank you so much for watching, everybody. And until next time, see you guys.